In continuation with our series on traditional Indian summer drinks, the ninth recipe in our series is a super nutritious drink known for its cooling properties and one of the best immunity boosters that you can have. Fermented Ragi Ambli, Ragi Kool, Finger Millet Porridge. You can find the links for all the episodes in the description box below. Welcome to Water Gravy. If you like my videos, do subscribe. And to not miss out on new videos, press the bell icon after subscribing. For the preparation, take 1 cup of ragi flour. Ragi is also known as kervaragu, finger millet, nachni. Ragi is a good source of fiber and aids in weight loss. To this, add 4 cups of water. Mix well. Ragi is gluten-free, rich in calcium, rich in B-complex vitamins, vitamin C and E. It also helps in the absorption of iron. Mix to ensure that there are no lumps. Cover with a cloth. Covering with a cloth ensures that there is a well aerated condition for the growth of beneficial microbes, thus aiding the fermentation process. Tie with a thread and leave for 6 to 8 hours or overnight. After 8 hours, open to check. You can see that bubbles have started to appear. The fermentation process has started. Add 3 more cups of water. Place on a stove. Switch on the flame and stir on a low flame. Using clay pots is beneficial while making fermented porridge because clay is porous and it has the right temperature and humidity for the development of beneficial probiotic bacteria. Keep stirring continuously to avoid the formation of lumps. Now it has begun to thicken. Allow it to boil for a few more minutes. Once it is cooked, the ragi ambli or kur will have a glass-like or glossy appearance. At this stage, switch off the stove. Allow it to cool. Cover and tie with a cloth and leave it overnight or for 8 hours. The fermentation process depends on the temperature. During summer, it ferments faster. Next day, remove the cloth and mix well. You can see that after fermentation, it has thickened slightly and has a smooth consistency. It also has a nice smell. Research has shown that the microbes which are responsible for fermentation have the ability to produce B12 vitamin. Add salt. Add more water if required. Now the ambli kur is ready to be used. Pour into glasses. Add 3 to 4 tablespoon buttermilk or according to taste. You can also have without buttermilk. Ragi when consumed on a regular basis is especially beneficial for lactating mothers and for people with chronic diseases. Take some small sambar or pearl onions, peel and cut into fine pieces. Onions have organic sulfur compounds in them which help reduce cholesterol. It also helps break down blood clots thus preventing heart disease and stroke. To get the most benefits, it is best to be consumed raw. Chop some coriander leaves. Top up the ambli with finely cut small onions and coriander leaves. Serve with green chilies, peel small onions, fried curd chilies, and sliced mangoes if in season. Probiotic and a good source of vitamin B12, this fermented ragi ambli kur provides sustained energy, controls diabetes, fights anemia improves digestion and boosts immunity. Also a perfect summer drink. If you like the video, do drop your comments below. Join me on Tuesday for another interesting traditional drink recipe.